Hey, what's up guys? So we are back right now uh, playing a little bit more Minecraft on our crafted server. You can see that we've uh, I've done a lot <clears throat> um, But it's all just been busy work nothing that uh, Really, I think would stand out much to you guys, but I made this little uh, garden area. You can see that I've got a whole bunch of um, Sugar cane in here so that I can make some uh, Pages and whatnot so that we can get an enchanting table going uh, and get a uh, get some enchants because that's going to be super important for us to uh, knock out so that we can get some really really good stuff <coughs> enchanted and whatnot. But um, I really just made it all look kind of cool. I'm probably not going to do anything with the melons and whatnot, but we got all the wheat going. I've added some waterfalls in here just to kind of make it look cool. Um, we've got our cow farm over here. These freaking jerks. Um, <laughs> and then I built a little path up from all of this just out of wood, kind of threw some random stuff on the ground. Um, and then we've got our cave right here where we've been sleeping. Eventually we're going to build ourselves a house, obviously. Um, but I've got all of my uh, storages and chests and whatnot. We've only got six diamonds right now, so i got to go mine. But in today's video, we are going to be making a mob farmer because I found a spawner. Um, so we're going to head down here into the cave, uh, which I haven't done too much in. I've just added these stairs in, in, this, in these little rails so I don't come down too fast and die right there. Um, but I got lost in here a couple of times. Thankfully, um, I've kind of figured out my way around. Um, but we just come right down here. And then I believe that the spawner, it's a zombie spawner. So I wish there was a skeleton spawner because of all the arrows that you get. But here's the spawner. And I'm sure that many of you guys know how to do this already. Um, so we might fast forward through this, but it needs to be nine blocks uh, by nine blocks <clears throat> and then two down from the spawner. So we're going to go down one and two just like this. And then I'm just going to work my way all the way around. My diamond pickaxe is going to sadly be uh, retired very soon. I need to eat some meat. Um, we've gotten a lot of meat from that farm actually, so that's been pretty helpful so far. Um, so we're going to do all this and I'm a little bit afraid that we might get some zombies spawning in here But shouldn't be too big of a deal. Um, I also do love getting this mossy cobble for designs and whatnot um, But I want to thank you guys who like this series for uh, leaving likes and supporting me on here um, I like to play other games besides clash. I mean clash is obviously my favorite game that uh, I play for you guys and I play it because I enjoy it obviously um, But I like minecraft too. me and BJ have a lot of fun with it um, oh, something just spawned. Get out of here. How did you already spawn? I need to throw some more torches up in here before we get freaking wrecked. <laughs> Come on. All right, uh, so let's keep on digging. Uh, I might fast forward through this. Uh, in fact, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to fast forward um, until we get nine wide and two down, okay? So uh, I'll be back with you guys once we are fast forwarded. All right, guys, so we are nine uh, spaces down now. <clears throat> so what we're going to do really quick is now we have to bring in um, all of our water buckets. And uh, <laughs> I filled up a whole bunch of them. And they are going to go uh, nine spaces. They'll, <clears throat> they'll work all the way down, but they won't. Uh, they'll stop at eight. So water only travels eight spaces. I'm sure that you guys know that. Um, but we can... Uh, take it from every other one or so and put it like that so those are all going to flow down like this and then we can do this and oh wait uh my bad i need to pick that up <clears throat> so then now what we do is we dig down one <clears throat> as y'all can see <laughs> it only goes eight so we're gonna dig all the way down here and uh there we go and then let's go up here and fill up one more bucket, even though it's going to be practically impossible for us to get up here. Uh, yeah, there we go. So, and then we're going to put this right here and this one right here. And you can see it's going to flow us right here into the center of all of this. Um, so next, what I'm going to do is have it come down and drop. Uh, it's going to drop 22 spaces, I believe it is. Um, I'm probably going to die from this. <laughs> Hopefully I don't fall too far into a cavern or anything. I don't need these. Um, so that's one, two, I'm going to end up drowning. Uh, let's, let's block this off real quick because I don't want to drown. I don't really feel like drowning today. 
um, put this right in here and one we'll put that right there and that's gonna stop us from drowning um, so we're gonna go down 22 blocks so right now it's gonna be one two three four I'll fill all this in later five six seven eight nine oh I'm getting scared <laughs> eight nine 22 is gonna be a lot 10 11 12 and this is gonna put them to where they're almost dead but they're not so that's 12 for us 13 14 15 16 17 18 uh oh <laughs> so we're gonna have to figure out something to do with this lava now uh, so 18 is where the lava is put that right there and uh, dig it out again so that's 18 and then let's put that block right in there why is that not stopping it there we go so that's at 18 and then hopefully nope ah oh, we're a bedrock uh, that sucks that's where the thing spawned though all right so we're gonna be at about 20 right here um, and we can't go any lower so we're gonna have to um, on my other on my other account you guys would have seen um, you would have seen the sweet skeleton spawner that I found that I oh no I'm gonna die oh my gosh I'm so freaking close all right let's fill that up um, all right so this is gonna be so there's the uh, the pit where they're gonna fall so they're gonna fall down in right here and um, they obviously aren't going to die now which is a little bit annoying um, <clears throat> we're gonna put this right here and let's see if I can go down one more can you even get rid of bedrock I don't think you can that's gonna be a noob question that you guys are probably gonna laugh at me for asking dang it there's more freaking lava there um, so we're gonna have to come down here to kill them right in here um, now we're going to need to build some stairs up into that area we'll end up having a little room here hopefully I don't uh, can you get rid of this I'm gonna see if I can get rid of bedrock with uh, the diamond you guys are probably cracking up yeah it's not going anywhere <laughs> so I know that all y'all are commenting no of course well you can't get rid of that um, so let's go ahead and start building up so we're gonna build up and we're just gonna go straight up this way because I know that that is where our uh, where our area is <coughs> And um, I'll go ahead and fast forward through all of this as well. And then we'll get up there. We'll get rid of the torches. And once all those are down, then I'll be back with y'all in a second, okay? All right, guys. So we are back. And we've been uh, AFK here for a little bit so that we can let some of these zombies spawn over here on the other side of <coughs> this wall right here. Let's just go ahead and throw that in. So we come down. And then here's our way out. So the spawner is actually right there. Um, and we built up and we had to build around it. Eventually, I'm gonna uh, make this double wide and whatnot um, So we come down here and I again, I really wish this was a skeleton spawner But again, this is fine. We come down here and you can see they're all just hanging out right here They've all got um, pretty low health. This is going to we can honestly just use this block right here um, We're at 34 uh, I'll probably just make a bunch of stone swords or something like that uh, and leave them down here to own them all with but we were at 34 uh, XP and um, obviously it's harder to move up but we could we're, we're gonna be able to get to 30 levels super super fast with this um, I did also bring down a couple up oh, see look, there's another one right there <laughs> so we might be able to get some armor and, and random stuff like that from down here uh, let's go ahead and do this as well um, oops didn't mean to do that 
we're gonna add some uh, some chests down here. <clears throat> Throw in some lighting back here, just behind this chest. Uh, so we'll put a little bit of lighting right there, and we're gonna take this out and let's go ahead and place our chests just like that. Again, we got that lighting back there to keep this whole place lit up and good to go. We might end up having to add in some more uh, some more chests in a little bit. The reason they aren't falling right now is because we're not up there. So normally you go AFK, you go to the bathroom, you get a drink or something, and you hang out by the thing and then you come down here. And they will all be down in here for you to come and wreck. So let's go ahead. <laughs> we got a whole bunch of tasty zombie flesh. Uh, that we can do nothing with. Actually, I think you might can use it for something. I've got no idea. If you guys know what it, what you can use it with, just comment that down below. Um, let's go ahead and actually let's make a crafting table down here as well. Up, oh, one of them just died, or he just fell down here. Um, we'll, we're gonna get some with uh, armor and random stuff like that. I don't know if we'll ever use that armor, honestly. Um, but who knows? We might. So let's go ahead and just. Uh, why don't we build a couple of swords with some stone? Two, three, four, yep. And we are just going to leave all of these <laughs> in this chest. So stone swords, and I'm sure that they're gonna drop some as well. So all we gotta do is come down here, grab a stone sword, and get to work. But something else that we're gonna do in this video, guys, is we're gonna head up real quick. Um, I can't wait to make all this actually look nice <laughs> because I hate when stuff doesn't look nice. Right now it's, it's just functional. Um, we will head right back up this way. I'm gonna get rid of all this wood and just make it look a lot better. Um, we're gonna head up this way. I need to add some lights in here, man. Shoot, it's way too dark right there. Uh, um, so we're gonna head up here, and hopefully, you'll probably never hear me say this, but hopefully it's dark out so I can show you guys uh, what it looks like at nighttime um, inside of, or outside of our base. I think that it looks pretty good. I've hidden the lighting really well, in my opinion. Um, and so let's come out of here and see how we're looking. It does look like it's nighttime, so it is nighttime. Um, hopefully I don't die as an enderman. I don't want to look at him. So we've got all the farm stuff going on. You guys can look up here. See all this lighting is hidden underneath these bushes, uh, which I think looks really, really good. And then we've got a lot of lighting hid up in here as well. You can't see any torches uh, except for this one, which I'll get rid of. There's some lighting back behind here. There's some lighting down there. Um, anywhere that you see plants, there's lighting. There's a torch back in there <laughs> you can see that one um, but I just really like the way that it looks with the bushes in here it actually makes it feel like a cave to me um, let's go ahead and sleep though and we'll wake up go kill a couple of mobs collect some more of that sugar cane so that we can get some paper uh, isn't it sugar cane yet yeah, oh oh no, no 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 get the freak away from me creeper I do not want to deal with you no 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 way was I still in range of him Oh my gosh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. He blew everything up. Oh, that's so freaking annoying, man. All right, let's, uh, where are our chests at? I'm not even gonna be able to grab our chests. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Get out of here, dirt. Oh my gosh, all I want is the freaking chest. It's gonna take me for, all right, I'm just gonna build new ones. Well, I can't because my freaking, is that in here at least? No, so that's not in here either. I cannot believe that that just happened. <laughs> All right, so we're either looking for a chest or we are looking, not for a lava bucket, or we are looking for a crafting table. Um, all right, screw it, I'm just gonna make another one. And then we're gonna make some freaking chests. That's so, so unbelievably annoying that that just happened. Uh, let's just put this one by the bed. Do we even have enough wood to make this? Yes, barely enough wood. Golly, that's freaking ridiculous, man. All right, so pick all this up. Let's get all of our valuables in here first. Diamonds. Let's just throw all of our diamond gear in here, uh, as well as let's just put. All right, now we're just gonna we're just gonna fill it up. <laughs> I cannot believe that just happened. And oh nope. Pick all this up. Did we get any more chests? That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, nope, we did not get any more chests. Gold, lava bucket, books. Throw all of that in there. All right, so that's all that we can do right now. Oh, I guess when you blow up a chest, it actually blows it up. That is one thing that I did not know, but that clearly I have now learned. Um, so let's grab a little bit more wood. And now we need to make more chests. Freaking annoying. 
<laughs> oh gosh. All right, so we're gonna throw this one up here. And then let's just put this one right next to this. That looks a little bit better and cleaner. Um, and we're just gonna pile all this in here. I'll organize this later. I don't want you guys to have to sit around. As you can see, we uh, we raided a uh, a temple and got some of that stuff. So that's always that's always fun to do. So we've got a whole bunch of sugar cane here. We've got some books. Uh, we've got these wood to make bookshelves with. And shoot, I'm gonna need to take some of my spruce right here and make some more stuff. I need to go. I need to go out and get myself some. Um, I don't want to use all of it. Uh, crafting table. Yep. All right. So let's go ahead and make all of our paper, and then we're going to make some uh, some bookshelves for our enchanting table, which I'm super excited about. Uh, I might try and. Oh, I guess I need to make an anvil too, don't I? Oh, how do I make an anvil? Uh, I know that it requires iron. So let's get some iron, and then is it? Nope, so that made a fence. That's an iron block. <laughs> I'm a noob. All right, uh, we don't want to make that. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to, come on. I'm going to search real quick and figure out how to make an anvil, and I'll be right back with you guys. All right, guys, so I figured it out. I needed blocks of iron <laughs> and some ingots to make the anvil. So here we go. We are going to make the anvil for us. And uh, let's go ahead and craft some books as well. So we got all those books. Uh, oh, we need to do this. I need to grab this leather right here. <clears throat> oh, the crafting joy. So we're going to make all these. Let's make seven of those. And I think that we might have some more. Do I not have any more? Uh... Well, I guess I don't. Um, I thought I might have some more um, books, but I guess I don't. I can't do this, can I? Nope. <laughs> oh, all right. So let's do that. Get this book, and then we're gonna make um, we're gonna make two more bookshelves, and then yeah, there we go. And let's see. So I already da, da, da. so I've got this over here. Um, we've got this all working out. I need to add some other stuff to it. But as you can see, let's see what we're looking at. So twenty four. Uh, so we're almost to 30, so I need to get a couple more bookshelves in here in order for us to um, finish things up. So let's go and kill a couple cows, all right, because I think that we have, no, we don't, so we're going to go, oh, well, that's kind of unfortunate. Uh, <laughs> forgot that that hole was there, where that freaking creeper blew it all up. At least we have that now. Um, so that looks a little bit better. I need to make another furnace though so that we can cook up some stuff. Um, let's walk on over here. This is going to be a, a longer episode for you guys, so I hope that you all are enjoying it. Uh, as you can see, I have set up all this stuff, uh, and I think that it's looking pretty good. Uh, did I miss one? Yep, I missed this one. All right, get in here. Get in my inventory. <clears throat> and I brought these over here. We're going to collect some wheat as well. Um, for us to get some, for us to feed the cows, and then for us to kill the cows. Oh, if I landed on that, I would have broken it. All right, so that is in our seven slot. So let's get up as much wheat as we can. Get over here, wheat, I need you. Uh, but guys, comment down below what you would like to see in this. Uh, I think me and Brian are just Kind of enjoying just building right now. Uh, I think that it's a lot of fun just to build. Get over here, wheat. Um, uh, and I'm sure that many of you would say the same thing uh, as well. So, oops, I knew that was going to freaking happen. I don't have my thing either. No. Dang it. All right, I'm going to have to fix that later. I totally shouldn't have jumped. <laughs> Normally what I do is I'll jump uh, in the waterfall and let it kind of transfer me over. We got some pumpkins up in here too. Well, I guess I can plant here now. We're going to get a lot of wheat from this. We can make bread. You guys can come over and we can make sandwiches together. Okay. <laughs> so what I've been doing to transfer is just jump over here into the waterfall like that uh, and jump back. And I think that I don't see any wheat down there. I just see a bunch of seeds, which I don't really need. Um, so we're doing this. 
I know, I know, kind of repetitive. But I'm excited for uh, just kind of making this all this livable. Uh, Madden Divinic and Nick at Night have both been on the server already. Uh, Nick was uh, building over in another area. So we're going to have to get him over here to us uh, so that we can get things working. But let's go over here and kill a couple of cows <clears throat> so that we can get some more leather. Feed them all up. We got a whole bunch of them. Come on, guys. Get hungry. So we're going to feed up some of them and uh, put this in there. And let's kill. Time to kill. Time to kill. We'll go over into the gate and just run in there and it'll just be a massacre. All right, who wants to die? It's dying time. It's dying time. Get out of here. All right, so we're getting a bunch of leather right now, which is exactly what I wanted. We can also use the meat. Obviously, we'll cook all that up. Oh, excuse me, baby cow, for killing your parents, but they're dead. You hear me? They're dead. Oh, all right, whatever. Uh, please don't escape, baby. All right, because you're, you're exactly what I need. I need you to be alive. Get out of here. That's what I thought. <laughs> oh, how'd that leather pop all the way out there? Did y'all see that? So we'll come up in here, make a couple more books, and we should have enough uh, sugar cane as well to get us going. We've got a whole bunch of paper. Uh, so let's make the rest of these pages first. I know some of these are super uneven. Uh, here we go. And paper, we've got so much freaking paper. So we're gonna make 16 of these. And then that should give us enough bookcases to get up to 30 levels. And then I think what we'll enchant first is our pickaxe. Uh, wait, no, I know we're supposed to enchant books. So we're gonna enchant a book. Um, so let's see how we can do uh, with bookshelves. I don't know how many more we need. Oh, well, let's just make this many right now and see how many we can get from it. So we're gonna get three bookshelves, obviously. And let's go ahead and put those up here. And then that should, I think that we need, all right, what can we do now? Do we see a 30? Yep, all right, so we see a 30, so we're perfect. Uh, I'll probably make another bookshelf and just put it there for the looks. But let's go ahead and, um, do I have any more wood? No more wood in there. <clears throat> And I've got a couple more birch that I can make. So let's go ahead and drop this in here. One, two, and that. So now we've got one more bookshelf. And then we've got a, a book we can enchant. So we're going to enchant a book real quick as well. Drop this right there. We're looking good up in here. I need to add some more lighting for sure. Uh, let's go ahead and do that before we get some freaking zombies spawning up in here. I don't want it that close. Um, so we'll get that there. We might add some more vines and whatnot up here. And let's just do one and two. There we go. We got a little creek going on in here. And let's click on here and let's uh, enchant a book with 30 levels. There we go. So we got knockback two. Sweet. So I'm going to put that on uh, probably a sword. I'm going to make a diamond sword. Uh, let's go ahead and do that now, actually. Let's make a diamond sword. So we're going to take one and two. And where are our sticks? I think we might have some sticks in here. We've got one stick, perfect. So let's go ahead and craft this sword and we're going to put knockback on it and then hopefully we can get a punch or something like that. I need to put my anvil down over here, don't I? Let's put the anvil uh, right here. So we're gonna drop that right, I wish that was an even number. We're just gonna put that right there. And then I believe that you do this and this and we get, wait. There we go. Enchantment cost three. So we're gonna get a knockback two right there. Sweet. So we've got a knockback two sword, which is pretty good. You guys let me know what you think about that. We're gonna, hopefully we add some power or um, punch to it or something like that. Maybe flame, that'd be pretty dope. Uh, I'm not really sure what all you can add at this point, but we've only got three levels left, so we're gonna have to uh, definitely use our zombie spawner for sure to do some work. But uh, that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. There is a lot in here. Uh, we're gonna go to sleep, and I will see you guys later on another episode. Hopefully me and BJ can go caving or something like that. But as always, guys, I'm gonna need y'all to make sure you keep calm and craft on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.